what's going on youtube world it's your girl kimberly in the kitchen so i wanted to show you guys uh my food prep now i cooked this earlier so all i had to do was of course bag it put it in my tupperware ready to go balanced meals good carbs good proteins my basic meals that i eat is like four to five meals a day and i eat the meals at the same time every day i eat breakfast at the same time i eat my first meal at the same time i eat my second meal scheduled at the same time my third meal scheduled at the same time and my fourth meal and my fifth meal scheduled at the same times every single day because i'm trying to change my metabolism and the only way again like i told you guys in the videos prior uh that you have to eat more and change in order to change your metabolism so for example look at this oh man that's some good stuff right there that is boneless skinless chicken strips with a touch of olive oil cut up some bell peppers and some onions and uh sprinkle a little goya seasoning on there and that's my second meal right there you guys know i eat rice but you got the the whole grain granola with the rice in the granola real healthy um good stuff this is my rice substitute right here this is not fat it's cocoa good stuff man real pure raw healthy balanced uh carbs to go along with my protein right here my second my third meal excuse me is uh about four or five slices of avocado and again boneless skinless chicken strips with the onions and the bell peppers cut up now i could which is also something i love doing i love ground turkey so sometimes i'll switch up and i'll have like the uh, chicken strips like this and then i'll have uh the ground turkey for my my third meal i'll switch it up and do like every other meal the chicken every other meal you know the ground turkey just so i don't get bored with it but today i had plenty i just cooked one bag of the ground the um chicken and so i just incorporated that into all four of my meals for the next day this is my fourth meal some bread which i'm actually going to get some ezekiel bread because it's actually better for you and uh the chicken my last meal of the day would be my chicken and my avocado slices i'm gonna tell you guys something about avocado <laughs> i am not a professional when it comes to the avocado but I have learned that touch the avocado. It needs to be soft, but not mushy. That's how you know that you're picking a great avocado. Um, if it's dark green, that's usually a sign that the avocado is a lot uh, better, that that's the one you want. Um, the lighter green is more of a riper color, no different than a banana. If you get a banana that's like really, really, really green, light green, then you know that banana is ripe. It's too ripe. You got to let it let, let the banana lighten up um, to make sure, that, you know, that it's edible. The avocado, get a dark avocado, touch it, feel it, squeeze it. You know, if it's mushy, you don't want to buy that one. But if it's soft to the touch, that's the avocado you want, you guys. So this is my last meal for the day right here. This is what I would be eating uh, with you know drinking some water along with this with all of my meals that i prepare for the day this is every single day if it's not uh chicken it's ground turkey either way I, i'm loving how i eat i feel good my body looks good my mind is good i even incorporate you guys know something that i love very very much is my mixed berries i cannot tell you how much I love now and can appreciate a good raspberry. I'm not I did not used to be a raspberry fan. This little creepy little hairy little thing here is is good. I got so I got raspberry on my fingers already. It is really good. It's uh it has a very acquired how should I say you have to acquire a taste for it. It's um, the texture of it is unique, but it's good. I eat it all the time, and my blueberries. So when I, you know, want to add in a little fruit, 
to my breakfast in the morning, I throw in a little fruit, a little mixed fruit like you see here. Uh, my first meal of the day, every single day, is basic oatmeal, plain oatmeal, and about four egg whites in the morning. And I'll also add in some mixed fruit. That's usually my first meal of the day, right here, with some egg whites. Original flavor. If you buy these little packets right here, do not get the box that has the strawberries and the maple and all of that crap is nothing but sugar. Get plain oatmeal. Nothing in this packet is just plain oatmeal. And I'll add a little cinnamon on it in the morning sometimes or I'll add a little agave, just a few drops to just give it a little, little taste to it. Um, but normally that's, that's it. The oatmeal, four egg whites and a little handful of mixed fruit. First meal of the day, second meal of the day, half a cup to, uh, a cup of rice with either ground turkey or the ground, I mean ground turkey or the boneless skinless chicken strips. I like the strips. You can get the boneless, skinless chicken breasts, uh, whatever you want to eat, as long as it's just a pure protein and doesn't have all the fat and the skin on it, okay? That's the point. My, what, what are you doing? Oh, okay, that's fine. Um, my third meal of the day would be slices of avocado, either with this ground turkey or with the ground chicken. The next would be normally Ezekiel bread, ground turkey or ground chicken or sliced chicken or chicken whole chicken breast or tilapia whatever fish or whatever you want to eat strong protein raw heavy heavy protein heavy healthy protein last meal of the day avocado chicken or ground turkey so i just wanted to show you guys this is how you get it done man if you don't have your food prepped if you don't have it organized it's going to be horrible for you i mean i don't even have to go to work i don't even need a job to know that I need to get my meals ready the night before so that my next day is very structured with eating regardless of what activities I have to do or accomplish that next day if my meals are ready my day is going to go good because no matter where I am I'm still going to have my meals on time and make sure I'm eating the right things and not eating a bunch of crap so Meal prep again, extremely important, extremely important. So make sure you guys prep your food, you know, on the weekends, on your day off. If you have that kind of energy when you come home from work, uh, you know, you mixing things up, change your food up. Have two different types of main proteins, whether you're incorporating, uh, like I said, turkey or chicken or fish. Switch it up, you know, maybe eat you know three times a day or three times a week one protein with your good carbs and then another three days you add in a different protein just so you don't get bored me i can go a whole day and eat the same thing like this doesn't bother me eating chicken all day tomorrow or ground turkey all day tomorrow doesn't bother me I'm, i love it it tastes good so i eat it, it I'm, not, I'm not bored with it yet so it's good it's okay <laughs> So structure, being prepared, being organized, having your meals ready, uh, take your weights to work with you, sit at your desk, enjoy your food, enjoy working out in the office, and all shall be real. And we shall get these bodies together to the degree of just healthy, not trying to look like anybody. Don't worry about what everybody else is doing. They're not as important as whatever your structure is, whatever your frame is, Whatever your DNA is, it is not as the next person. So don't try to achieve looking like somebody else. Just achieve whatever is the best for your body on your level of health. All right? I love you guys. Putting my food up. Time for me to go to bed. Keep subscribing and keep watching my videos.